Shalom. This is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. I want to start off by saying thank you to all of our Booster Club members for your many donations and much more your prayers. We visited faraway countries and strange lands. We've even spoken to dignitaries and were detained for spreading the glorious gospel in Cuba. The truth is that the descendants of the 12 tribes of Israel were scattered throughout the world. Help us on our journey as we continue to raise up the nation of Israel. 12 tribes worldwide. Join or donate today. Shalom. You have the Christian church, the Catholic church, Buddhism, Islam, they driving God's children away from the truth. This is in the Bible. You, you, you're pushing them away. All right? Anytime you show a white image of Christ, you're pushing them away from the truth. All right? Anytime you say, oh, it's okay to eat whatever you like, oh, you pray over it, you push them away from the truth. Right. Because the Bible has a dietary law. Yes. Things that you should not eat, things that you should eat. You understand? The Bible has a dress code. Things that you should wear, things that you shouldn't wear. That's right. You're pushing them away. How you doing, my brother? Yeah, you want to know what that cost me? I'm going to show you what that cost me. All right? Hold on. We keep reading. We're going to get into it. All right, and the angels, the Lord's been visiting the earth already. Right. When you see tornadoes and earthquakes start to take place, that's going on right now as I speak. All right, uproars, uproars. Let me just get that real quick in um, Matthew 24, and then I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get to you on the cross. All right, I'm gonna ask you as you look for them, I ask you a question. You got any children? Yeah, I got. A son. You got a son. Got God forbid, a son. if your son was gunned down in the streets, right? With an AK-47, would you rock that AK-47 around your neck and put it on the chain? Exactly. How does that sound? When Jesus the Christ, the Black Messiah, that's right, was nailed to a cross that you got on your neck. Right, but he's not. He's not on that cross. He was resurrected. Absolutely, he was resurrected. But no, you miss. Hello, you missing the point. I don't. Want, I'm not utterly with any kind of hey, bring it out. Uh -huh. like that, like this. But let me, you know, like, you know what I want, give me uh, that, 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 yeah. that, that. You, you play with these? Yeah, and then, then I said, Let me ask you something. That, that thing you got across, around your neck, which is called a cross, yeah. right? Right. What does that, what does that, what does that benefit you? It benefits me a great, a great, great, great. Really? He said it benefits him a great, a great benefit. Yeah, Look how he's holding it too. Without, without him, nothing is possible. Without who? With God. God is so the black what, what, what did you say that is? God is the black Without him, nothing is possible. Oh, oh, okay. All things up. What you got? Okay, let's get that. The book of Habakkuk, chapter 2, verse 18. Check it out. What profited the graven image? That's a question. What profited the graven image? Read. That the maker thereof Somebody, um, somebody actually made that. A maker of uh, have graven it, meaning they formed it. Read the molten image. The molten image. It was, it was formed and shaped into that thing. Read and a teacher of lies. Also a teacher of lies. Right. That thing right there around your neck teaches white supremacy. That's, That's, right. Right. That's what that teaches. Right. Where every time somebody look at that, they see the white image of Christ in their mind. Right. right. You understand? Read what you got. Destruction, the word war was about me, destruction, read it again. Woe unto him that saith to the wood, awake to the dumb son. Say, you awake, 
I pray to each with a neck in. It says, woe coming to that person. You got to be mindful, my brother. Now, you're an older brother, and we're not out here getting on you, but we're here to build you up. You understand? But guess what? You've been in the church since you were a little kid. Let me tell you that. I'm going to separate when you guys, like the rain, when it comes down from the earth and goes to back to the sky. But I love you guys. You guys are people with good skills, uh, education. Hold on. Stick around because you can learn something. I have something to do. Let me ask you a question then. Let me ask you a question. I need to go home. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Do you think you can learn from us young prophets? Yes, I can. So give me two minutes. Give, give, give me two minutes. Yeah, false prophets. False. Listen. The book of Job, chapter 32, verse 9. You know, man, let's get that. Now, the Bible said, great man is not always wise. How do we know that? We've been approved out of the Bible. We looking, we're clearly looking at you with a cross on your neck, man. I'm going to have it on here. You going to have it on there? Yeah. Guess what? If you won't repent before Christ return, you're going right. to be put to death. Right. I, 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 I hope and pray that you repent. I, 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 Read what you got. The book of Surah, chapter 19, verse 29. Uh -huh. A man may be known by his look. A man may be known by his look. Read. And one that has Understanding by his countenance. And one to have understanding by his countenance. That's right. When thou meetest him, I just met you. And I can tell you right now, you ain't got no understanding. But that's not an insult. No, no. Read on. A man's attire. Uh, a man's what? Attire. What's attire? What you clothed with? What you got on? Your apparel. Read. And excessive laughter. Excessive laughter. Read. And gait. And the way you walk. Show what he is. Everything about you, show me what you is. No, everything now, you said you, you grew up in the church, right? You, 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 know, you grew up in the church? You show me what you is. Christian church, right? Christianity? Baptist. 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 See that? How I know that? Read it again. A man may be, a man may be known by his look. Uh -huh. And one that has understanding by his countenance. And one that have understanding by his countenance. I know you by your look, brother. You, know what you understand? You know. Read on. When thou meetest him, a man's attire no. and excessive laughter and gait show what he is. So let me ask you this question. What are you doing for the community? Are you telling the gangbangers to put the guns down? Yes, I do. I talk to are you right here on the corners teaching and telling the, the ladies to stop prostituting themselves? I talk to them all the time. But they, why are they not listening to you? Because hey, they not listening to you. No. Let me show you why they not listening to you. Give me Leviticus 21 to 5 again. They're not listening to you because you're a hypocrite. Hey, That's what you are. You, know what? you got a crucifix around your neck. You, know what? you have no beard on your face. Hypocrite. Listen, humble down and learn, brother. Humble down. Humble you down know. and learn. You don't know. Read what you got. The book of Leviticus, oh. chapter 21, yeah. verse 5. Hey, you love God. Okay, you Do you, you love, love God? That's the first stone. First I'm going to show you who I am. Let's get that. You ain't you, you trying to say I can't judge? Give me, give me second. Give me first Peter. No, was it second? Three? Yeah, three? Three and nine? Yeah. Let's get that real quick. You think it's a joke? We not we didn't come out here to play games. No we didn't come out here to play games with our people. That's right. All right. Our people are sick. Our whole head is sick. Yeah, okay. And we're gonna tell you, we're gonna show you your sin, whether you like it or not. That's right. Matter of fact, let me get that whole Let me get that scripture. We're gonna show you your sin, whether you, whether they forbear. Alright? We're gonna show you your sin. Grow your beard and take that crucifix off the neck. That's right. All right? Like Christ talk. His voice was loud like many waters. 
like a Trump read. And so, my people, they're transgressing. I'm going to show you your sin. I'm going to show you your transgression. You in the midst of sin, brother. You got to repent. You're too old for that. Right. Come on down and learn something. That's right. All right? Read. In the house of Jacob, their sin. In the house of Jacob, their sin. All right? Go back to what you was holding. The book. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone, 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.